federal judge in Florida voiding the national mask mandate, exceeding the authority of U.S. health officials, a U.S. district attorney, cutting out the mandate as it pertains to airports and other forms of transportation. The judge saying that the CDC failed to justify its decision and didn't follow proper rulemaking. Uh, you'll remember the mask mandate was recently extended by the CDC, which was set to end on April 18th to May 3rd to allow more time to study the new Omicron variant, with which they were just talking about, uh, that's responsible for the majority of new COVID-19 cases. Well, we've been trying to assess the latest from the White House as the press sec secretary couldn't really comment on it during her briefing there, but now we're hearing from an official saying to Fox News that the agencies are reviewing the decision and assessing potential next steps. In the meantime, today's court decision means CDC's public transportation masking order is not in effect at this time. Therefore, TSA will not enforce its security directives and emergency amendment requiring mask use on public transportation and transportation hubs at this time. The CDC still recommending that people continue to wear masks in indoor public transportation settings. So that means if you are on a flight right now and are not wearing your mask, you are not going against the mask mandate. It has since been rescinded here. So what could be next with the Biden administration as we'll likely see pushback on this ruling? We'll be speaking with experts later on here on Live Now from Fox. We'll also be speaking with reporters who are at airports getting reaction from those travelers uh, who no longer have to wear a mask anymore uh, because of these changes.